Hey, everybody, and welcome back to another Wobbly Wednesday. So, you know what? I started off this morning the same way I have been starting off every day for the last couple of weeks, and that's by flying up to the mine and running through the mining mission five times. And it turned out to be a pretty good run today, including this one where I hit several diamond and one uranium mine and, and made $200 on, on this one run, which is always nice when you break the $200 mark. So I drove it down to the pet store, deposited it in the ATM, and discovered that we were at $18,908. And that means we have enough money to buy every vehicle in Wobbly Life, assuming my math is correct, and that is a big assumption. The first thing I did was drive over to a phone booth and take a look at the cars that we already own. And you'll see I have the rocket car unlocked, um, the motorcycle, the limo, the hamster ball, the caveman car, uh, the balloon tank, the toxic waste car, the golf cart, the hoverboard, the jelly car, the p undercover police car, the clown car, the sofa car, or couch car, depending on what you prefer, and the high-speed police car. Now, these are all cars that you can unlock by either completing missions, uh, finishing museum exhibits, or just finding in the world and unlocking. And we have made videos showing you how to get each one of those cars. So today, we are focused only on the cars that you have to buy in the game. So the first cars we're going to get involve driving up to the mountain research base, going into the lab with the shrink machine, getting shrunk down, and then driving over here to the table that has the globe on it. Because underneath that table is a little vendor where you can buy two vehicles. This miniature race car and the water bottle car. And once we buy both of those, the nice thing is we can just respawn and you can choose to respawn inside the lab. And then if you respawn again inside the basement of the science lab, you'll appear out here right up the street from the treasure map vendor. So I'll just jump into this RV, and then I'm gonna drive over to the nearest phone booth. And over here, I'm gonna grab the, um, we're gonna grab the mini race car. And the nice thing about these two cars is they do size up once you're outside the, uh, the lab. And just like the couch car and some of the others, they are completely indestructible. Which is nice, because, you know, if you guys have been watching me play Wobbly Life for a while now, you know my driving skills are absolutely terrible. Alright, so our next stop is the car dealership located in the city, just down the street from the pizza place. Um, yeah. Just down the street from the pizza place. Right over here on the left with the uh, inflatable guy out front. And there are a lot of vehicles to buy here. We have the, the um, uh, hang on, the three wheeled vehicle, which is impossible to drive, the four door sedan, the tractor, the convertible, the pickup truck, the station wagon, the army jeep, the forklift, the monster truck, the flatbed truck, the flatbed truck with walls, the furniture delivery truck, the tree cutting truck, and finally, the wobbly camper, the RV. So I'm going to come outside and I'm going to run over here to the phone booth right next to the place. And I think I am going to pick the uh, forklift for the next part of our mission. And that involves driving over to Paradise Island because that is where the other car dealership is. And they have completely different vehicles than this car dealership. 
Okay, this this does not go very fast. But I but I have to admit it handles better than I expected it to. All right, you know what? We're going to stop here at this phone booth and we're going to change vehicles again. And this time I think we're going to grab the um let's grab the tractor this time. Let's see how this this handles. Well, honestly, this this is actually slower than the forklift. Anyway, we need to uh, drive past the Coast Guard rescue place here, up the hill, to Magic Motors here on the right. And this is where we buy the final four vehicles in Wobbly Life. All right, so let's run inside. Hello, sir. Yes, I know I came on a tractor and this is a high-end store, but I'm going to buy things anyway. So the first thing we have is the brand new quad bike or 4x4 that was added in the latest update. Then we have the muscle car, the fancy Rolls Royce, and finally the sports car. And these are all very expensive. So much so that if you look, we have been reduced to $2,028. If you remember, we started today with $18,908. So to buy all of the vehicles in Wobbly Life cost us $16,880. That is a lot of money. And I will be honest, I'm kind of depressed after all that work to be back to having $2,000. I mean, yes, I own all the vehicles, but that was a lot of work. But hey, now I have this fancy sports car that I can drive through the streets of Wobbly Life. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to drive it over to Grandma's house. Woohoo! All right, here we are. And there's my flamingo. Hey, buddy. Hi. Oh, I wish we could bring you in the car with us, but, but the developers won't let us because they're meanies. Grandma, Grandma, I, I got you something. You're, you're so proud of me. Oh, thank you. Oh, I'm sorry, sorry. I forgot. I'm not supposed to touch you. But look, I bought you a brand new car, Grandma, for all you've done for me. Uh, look, Jellyman's excited. You gonna, what? What's that? You're going to take it for a ride? All right, Granny. Well, you be careful out there. Whoa, whoa, see? Anyway, that's going to do it for this episode of Wobbly Life. If you guys are enjoying it on the channel, please hit that like button and we'll keep bringing you more of it. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. It really helps us to grow the channel and you never miss an episode of Wobbly Life. We'll be back soon with more videos for you guys. Thanks for watching. Woohoo! Well, that didn't last long.